Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Carson Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to upload or download files in Microsoft Teams. And also I'm going to show you how to open files in Microsoft Teams. So I have two computers here. One is the 006 and the other one is 005. And 006 if I go to chat, I'm chatting with my peer named Adam. So for me to send a file to Adam, I have to go into the chat and choose his name. Or if I have not ch chat with him before, I can search for his name under contacts. So I have no contact listed here. I can have more option and add a contact. Or I can search for, just say if I want to search for Chris. Here it is. So now, since I'm here chatting with Adam, I can, I can send him a file. To send a file, you can either uh, drop the files drag and drop like just say if I want to send this file all I have to do is just drag it and put it in here in the chat sections Let minimize this a little bit okay let's do this again here it is you check you drag it to the where it says type your message here is a file for auto discovery and hit enter. Now the file has been sent. Also, you can click on the paper clip here, the attach icon, and you can upload it either from OneDrive or from my computer. So if I want to upload it from my computer, I just click on upload from my computer. And if I want to send this file, just click on it and type in your message. Here is CCO, hit enter. The file will be sent or is already sent. So that's how you send files between a person and a, to a person. If you want to know where the files are located, the, once you send the file, it is stored under file sections. These are all the files that are that are, that you have shared between you and Adam. And if I want to download this file again, I can just click on more options here download or get link or open it online if i want to open this file i have three options here i can add it in teams i can open it in browser and i can open it in desktop app let me see if i can open it with desktop apps So I cannot open it with desktop app. It's because I don't have Microsoft Word installed on this computer. But I can open with the browser. So you should be able to open Word documents in the browser. Excel, Word, PowerPoint. You should be able to open it with the browser, even the PDF files. But you cannot, if you don't have Office installed on your computer, you won't be able to open it from your desktops. So this is where you send files um, between each individual users. And if I want to send files, oh, hold on, let me take a look at the 
This is, should be under Chris. So if I look here, Chad, I'm Chris signing in. Bobby have sent me a bunch of files here. This is all the files I received. I can click on the three ellipses and open it with the desktop apps or open it with the browser. This computer has Office, so I should be able to open it with the desktop app. Hmm. Let's go back to chat. Okay, I have word on here. I should be able to open it with the desktop apps. Maybe I have not activated my word on my Office 365 software. So, same thing here. Um, all the files that were sent to me is located under files. Here it is. And if I want to go to Teams, this is for the Teams collaborations. Just say if I go to Sales and Marketings, the same thing here. I can send files by dragging and drop here, or I can click on the attachment. And the files will be stored under Files tab. Let me go back to the other computer. I'm going to send a files in Teams. Sales and Marketing, Listen to File, here's the file, I can type in a message or I can just hit enter, the file has sent and it should store under files locations, and I should be able to open this files. I, you can open this files by click on it or you can download this file by clicking on the three ellipses and click on download or you can just check the box and click on download here so that's it folks that's how you download or upload files in Microsoft Teams. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have a wonderful day.